It is Friday and look who's here. It's Linda Cook with some nasty weather expected this weekend. Might be a good idea to catch some movies and you've got a couple of them to talk to us about here. So let's start with one about the Pope. This is called In Viaggio, right? Right. And that Where means, do we see this, well, first of all? Well, it's, it's both these movies are streaming because okay. An Andy told me, he said, I'm talking about thunderstorms this week. Right. And I thought, okay, we're going to give people something they can watch in the comfort of their own homes, right? right so let's give people the lo lowdown on this one. This is a, a director who followed the Pope for several years in various continents, various countries, and various settings. You see the Pope in a plane. You see him greeted by throngs of thousands of people. You see him briefly in solitude. I like what the director did. He kept his distance. You figure out exactly what you think kept of these distance, gatherings. But yet was given some pretty extraordinary access. Absolutely. Some of this is footage from other places, of course. But I really like this movie. And I'm not Catholic. I have to say that. I just thought this was an interesting glimpse at the very complex life of one of the most famous men and revered in the world. What do we learn most about from this? I think the the transitions the Pope must go through or does go through from clamor to armed security guards to parades to that moment when he can breathe. It's it's just an amazing movie to watch and the behavior of the people never cease to amaze and me. And you gave it a pretty good rating here. Three out of four stars. I really right. liked it. So movie number two well, we're not that far from the loop, right? Out of the loop looks at stand-up and the history of stand-up in the Chicago area. And in this movie, if you're a stand-up fan, you're gonna see people that you know, you might meet a few that you don't know, but they recount the days when Chicago had very few places for stand-up comics, and you had to beg to go on the stage when there was dead air between musical acts or whatever. Um, it's funny, it's fast, and I like the way that the talking heads transition. It's sometimes serious, too, uh, when there's some pretty serious moments about racial divide in audiences and in clubs. I highly recommend this movie, and I give it three out of four stars Another as well. movie where you're getting extraordinary access to something that maybe you wouldn't normally. Exactly. It's really, really interesting, and I like documentaries, so once in a while, I get to talk about them. And so you gave this one three stars as well. As well. Mm -hmm. All right. Very good. Well, Linda, thank you so much. Some good movies for us to think about for uh, over the weekend on the streaming side. Any service for both either of those? Almost every one of them has these. They're everywhere okay. on multiple platforms. All right. Very good. Thanks, Linda. All right. If you want to see Linda's full reviews, you can check it out at rquadcities.com.